Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, Pixel Blast. This video is going to be based on a uh, tip. I'm going to show you how to apply color to your grayscale drawing um, using a modifier. And the modifier I'm talking about is the gradient map. It's not like Photoshop, per se, uh, where Photoshop would take its own separate layer and use that uh, modifier. The Procreate um, modifier directly changed the color on the um, painting you're doing. So I'm going to show you a character that have multiple different set of colors on them on a way how to buy layers on how to color a character on a fast, easy way. One of the many ways you can do it using that modifier. So the first thing we're going to do is into layers, add the character separately on this own layer. <clears throat> I'm going to make about four duplicates. Save one just for safekeeping, if, you know, just in case you mess up, you know, you always can go back. Um, but the first one we're going to go to is his uh, purple layer. He's mostly purple. Then you have uh, some yellows on him and some brown and certain on his lower legs. But the first one we're going to do that, go to where the magic one is, into gradient map. And I'm going to go into different shades in the darker area where the black is, you know, the darker tones of the gray. And in around that area, I'm going to put different shades of purple in there. Um, you can see. Um, you can see it's starting to change. Um, some of the shading area where his chest is a little bit and I kind of like that look you know basically a happy accident given this like a certain texture to his suit um, so I, I went with that um, I want to make sure I have the highlights behind him where I had the lighting was coming by him more brighter by him. <clears throat> excuse me Now the next thing we're going to do is on the layer we just finished putting the color on we're going to erase the areas we're going to put the colors other colors are um, the yellow and the uh, brown so around his um, hands and forearm area um, and around his feet and lower legs area for the brow um, then after that um, we're going to go to the next layer and add the yellow. Same thing as we did with the purple. Um, and then on that layer, um, we're going to delete the, on the yellow layer, delete the, um, which is the third layer. We're going to de delete the area where we're going to have the brown. So basically, we each layer is going to have their own separate colors. And we're just erasing the area. Um, you're gonna see the next color on the on the next layer. It's pretty simple and easy. Um, a more easier way I think uh, to use, you know, just to add color to your grayscale um, paintings. Right, I'm gonna speed it up so you won't be so bored to watching it.
quick note here uh, what I did after I erased the areas um, I select this layer and then on the next layer while I still in selection mode um, what I did is uh, deselect the head area and the arms um, and then just delete because um, it's going to delete the the um, the leg area where I'm going to put on the next layer the other color the third layer um, just to make it go faster um, then go in just uh, color this whole second layer with yellow it's pretty much fast and easy yeah okay the next area is the, uh, the feet uh, which are brown tin brown I guess um, but it's almost finished. Um, I hope you guys enjoy this tip I showed you um, in Procreate. Uh, but if you guys enjoy this, please leave a comment, like, share, um, please subscribe. And I can probably do more of these if you guys want. Uh, but also, I'll be doing some uh, 3D sculpting as well. Hopefully, I'll be dropping the next one pretty soon. Uh, so... Be on the lookout for that. Alright guys, bye.